Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel. This is another grocery haul video. Um, this is going to be our grocery haul for Holy Week. Um, so, what is that? Like the second through the ninth or something like that. Um, this is only part of the grocery haul because I haven't uh, shopped for our Easter dinner. Um, the commissary was out of lamb. They also didn't have ham. So they had neither of the options. So we're actually gonna have to go to pay less and find out if we can pick up some things for our Easter dinner and a few more things um, that they did not have at the commissary for our Passover meal. So um, let me show you what we got from the commissary and then later on I'll show you what we find hopefully at Payless. So let's start uh, with the bread. We got four loaves of bread. The kids will be having peanut butter and jelly toast this week for breakfast. I got four loaves, um, two loaves for that, and then I got some loaves for the little kids to have yeah. sandwiches this week for lunch. We are going down to having one day, which is Friday, that we will have cereal. So we got a giant size of Apple Jacks. So Apple Jacks will be what they have this Friday for lunch. Um, and actually, Lynn and Jackson and Mackenzie are going to be going on a hike on Friday. So they might actually pick up something else for lunch or have something else for breakfast, I mean. But this is what is for breakfast for everyone else, not lunch. Let me correct that. This is breakfast. I also found this Ezekiel bread. Uh, we've never tried it. I'm pretty sure I tried it years ago, but the kids, uh, we've never had it together. So I just picked up some of the Ezekiel bread, the cinnamon raisin for us to try. We saw it in the freezer and I was like, oh, this is a great week to try that. So I picked some of that up. We are having barbecue chicken wraps and uh, Taco Tuesday. And so I got more tortillas for that. I saw this Japanese dinner rolls. <laughs> they feel really, really soft. So I just picked those up just to try with what I have cooking right now. And some Parmesan cheese for my Caesar salads. Uh, we really love this Tillamook brand cheese. So I got some of the shredded medium cheddar. Also some string cheese for the boys. Um, they did not have our link sausage. So we're going to try this Jimmy Dean sausage patties. We're going to be having um, pancakes and sausage on Saturday morning. So that's what this sausage is going to be used for. I grabbed some bugles. I'm going to be portioning these out into snack bags for uh, the kids for school. Next, I picked up some matzo crackers. Um, just for our Passover meal. Um, it's one of the things that I started getting a couple of years ago. This is actually a bigger box than what we usually get though. So I was glad to see that. So Passover crackers. I also got hummus for our Passover meal. I got some spicy hummus, some roasted red pepper hummus, and some roasted garlic hummus. So that'll be for that. And we're actually gonna be celebrating our Passover meal on Friday. Y'all know we have Civil Air Patrol on Thursday, so we won't be celebrating it on Monday, Thursday. We'll be celebrating it on Friday, Friday evening. Um, I got some ranch dip for our veggies, some more sliced cheese, and a medium cheddar block cheese. And this Kerrygold Pure Irish Butter was on sale, and I had to get it. So um, I really love this butter, and I never get it because it's always so expensive, but it was actually only $3 and something. So I grabbed some. I got two things of eggs um, for two breakfasts this week. Um, I'm going to have to buy more eggs, though, for Easter so we can have deviled eggs. Three gallons of milk. Um, we also got some orange juice for them to have for breakfast. 
and we're just in love with the blueberry and lemonade so i got some more of that probably should be buying two or three of these but i just got one for our fruits and veggies we got some we got a pineapple some green apples and gala apples i believe this is i can't ever tell because they don't have it labeled but they're they're little and that's just perfect for our kids size eating them uh, they've been loving the oranges so we got more oranges grapes the purple grapes are pretty much um for our passover meal but the kids love to snack on green grapes so i got two of those um a cantaloupe for me to cut up for this week to snack on some peppers for our passover meal oranges for salad oh they had cuties this week too so i grabbed those for the little boys um i got some more carrots to snack on with that ranch dip over there cucumbers these two cucumbers will be for um passover bananas we like buy bananas like all week long so here's more bananas and so that is the fruit and vegetables that we got i picked up some maxwell house curried cups um just because i'm kind of missing the taste of the maxwell house which is what we usually drink so i grabbed two boxes of those they were actually on sale though and that's the reason why i went ahead and grabbed two of them I got some sparkling red grape juice and green grape juice for our Passover meal. Um, some more olive oil spray, lemon juice. We needed peanut butter. They didn't have the commissary brand, so I just grabbed Peter Pan. And some crunchy. Grab this taqueria verde sauce for our Taco Tuesday. This Italian seasoning I use in our Mississippi pot roast, which I forgot to buy last week. So, um... I grabbed some of it today. We were out of grape and strawberry jelly, so I grabbed those, plus some raspberry preserves and blackberry preserves. We got some garlic stuffed olives and some fig spread, both for a Passover meal. We're having spam and eggs on Monday morning, so I grabbed two things of spam. And Monday evening, we are having beef and broccoli, so I needed some stir-fry sauce. I'm going to serve our beef and broccoli with rice and with noodles. So I got some stir-fry sauce to fry the noodles in, soy sauce I hadn't bought yet, and some sesame oil. More Vienna sausages for the little boys to snack on. Also, I needed some brown sugar for the beef and broccoli. We're having oatmeal for breakfast. We're going back to the way that we used to do breakfast um, where we're actually gonna eat breakfast together. This um, pick what you wanna eat thing does not work. So we're gonna be having oatmeal, I believe on Tuesday. We have the maple brown sugar already in the cabinet and so I grabbed some fruit and cream. Um, we're having pancakes, like I said, with that sausage on Saturday. So I grabbed some of that. We found these and of course this is Lynn's favorite candy especially when it's in the fridge. So we got a big box of those. Just so many marshmallows for the little boys to snack on. And here are some extra things that I'm just gonna stick into their Easter baskets. I thought these were cute. The camo beans for the boys, which have chocolate pudding, green apple, licorice, juicy pear, toasted marshmallow, and watermelon inside. And then I grabbed this one, the sours for Kenzie. I don't know if you can see that. Sour apple, sour cherry, sour grape, sour lemon, and sour orange. And then I just got a regular one from Mallory, which has 20 different flavors, like strawberry cheesecake and sun-kissed tangerine. So those looked good. All right, so our non-food items, we got more paper plates. And I got all different sizes of bags, gallon, sandwich, and um, quart size bags. And I wanted something to be brushing away the dead skin, so I got some skin scrub here. And just needed some shaving cream. This glass cleaner was on sale. And then I got this container. It goes in the fridge. It's a pantry basket, but I'm going to put it in the fridge um, to put the grapes in. So we'll have a whole container of grapes in the fridge. So this is what we've got for right now before we go to Payless. And hopefully they will have um, the lamb that I'm looking for there at Payless. I don't know how much it's gonna be. Y'all pray for us, okay? 
All right, so we're gonna get this put away and then the little boys are sleeping. We're gonna head to pay less and hopefully find some type of meat for our Sunday dinner. Hey y'all, we're here again trying out a new store, kind of like Costco, but not really, no membership. Here we are, it's called Cost You Less. Just gonna follow this nice looking man right here into the store. Cost you less, your best value. Thought we'd try here before we go and check pay less for that lamb. We have found my favorite salsa, the La Mexicana salsa, and they even have a large container of it. Ten ninety nine, well worth it, y'all. This is the best stuff ever. All right, so from cost you less, we picked up some Pringles. I just said today at the commissary that I wish they had single little Pringle packets for them to take for snack to school, and here they were at cost you less. So we got 36 cans of Pringles. I found these two Stone Fire Naan for our Passover meal. Some more romaine lettuce for um, Caesar salad that I eat during the week. Lynn grabbed a Spam with Tocino to try, Tocino seasoning. Here is the La Mexicana mild salsa that I am going to love to eat this week. Some sugar, we actually forgot to get sugar at the commissary. Found this large bag at um, it cost you less. Now, I, don't, I did not pay attention to how much this stuff costs, so next time I'll be sure to pay attention to that. The watermelons, I believe, are 99 cents a pound, I think. Um, so we grabbed a watermelon. I also found this Monopoly uh, Go Green made with 100% recycled paper. Green up to clean up. And um, it's like the different cards are like you put solar panels on your doghouse. You plant native wildflowers in your garden to save the bees. Our kids really like, um, look at the little wood houses and dice. So we really um, enjoy collecting Monopoly. Y'all know that. So got that one. And then Reed has to take snack uh, this month for his class. And these were on sale for $12.99 for the 40 pouches. So we went ahead and picked up one of those. So we got this from Cost You Less. All right, so from Payless, we found our uh, lamb leg roast. So we will make our lamb roast on Sunday for Easter um, with the shiitake mushrooms, um, Yukon gold potatoes, celery, and carrots. So all that's going to go in the roast. I'll be making some hot cross buns, so I needed some flour and a baking powder. Um, some bay leaves for the roast, yeast for the hot cross buns, um, rosemary for the roast. I also picked up some of these skewers because Thursday night when we have, or Friday night when we have our um, Passover meal, we will be having chicken and salmon. So, um, it'll be like Mediterranean chicken skewers um, with salmon. And I have to, I could not find tzatziki sauce at any of the stores, so I'm going to have to make it from scratch. So, that's the only thing that we have left to buy. And I may actually make some pita bread as well. So, I couldn't find pita bread. Apparently, everybody's out of pita bread. And I did not see any tzatziki sauce. So, we're going to have to make that on our, our own. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. So, that's yeah. it. Um, we, it took us a little while just because, you know, we enjoy, uh, seeing all the new stores and the cost you less store was really cool. I took some photos of prices of things, um, like oatmeal that I want to compare to the commissary to see if it's cheaper for me to buy it in bulk here. Um, but other than that, we're going to get this stuff put up and we are going to enjoy our friday night today's friday so we're actually bowling with the chapel tonight so we're gonna go get ready for that and thank you all for joining us um stay tuned for next week and the grocery haul that's coming bye i
Sunshine